I'm Ralph McCadam, and this is British Bits. Today we're going undercover at the British Museum to expose uh, bits of fraud and disinformation perpetuated by the British Museum. Take as an example of fraud this gnome door used by the little people of Denmark. You see the door's tarnished green copper hinges. That's what happens to copper when it gets old. Uh, the hinges are on the same side as the doorknob. So this door was built incorrectly. But it is indeed a gnome door from Denmark. And what does the British Museum say? <clears throat> that is a, a bronze belt buckle from Germany. Not only is that a fraudulent summation, it's also a boring one. Case closed. There is truly no other greater soap sculptures. Sorry. There is truly no other greater soap sculpture in the world than this one uh, of the Darga killing the demon Mashashura. But what will the British Museum have you believe? That the sculpture is made from pith from the inside of the Shola reed. So here again is another sad case of the British Museum being the British Museum this statue of a country squire is made out of a substance called white clay. And what does the British Museum have to say? Have to um, what does the British Museum have to say? That it's a statuette, not a statue, of a sportsman, not a country squire, and that it's made of off-white stoneware. Also note. Uh, where a careless museum employee has squashed the nose. Case closed. This is a statue from Greece that the British Museum let fall into disrepair. Uh, notice the stains of museum workers' blood on the torso. Notice the testicles looking more like a collection of snails than testicles. This then Britain, this is your British Museum at its best, or should we say at its worst. I'm Rafe McCadam, and this has been British Bits.